welcome back our application is getting root so we are, in this video we are going to tackle creating a header component and then you are going to make use of styling based on different platform like I said in my previous video so let's get started so for the first time we are going to create a separate component and then render it inside our app component so we are getting our hands dirty now so let's see how to structure folders in react native so let's create um, a folder a folder called src perfect and in there you can create a subfolder called screens or components but i'll make use of screens like that and my first screen i'm going to create is called header screen like that and dot js and because i have my extension being installed for year seven years is react, react redux i'll make use of react native functional component export with star sheet boom and then i have it so here um let's try to import view is there automatically and then here let me call this one the news all right so now let's render this one by going to the app component and then let me delete everything for my app component because this one was using for demonstration purposes and let me in, in bring in or import my header component and i think i can have my auto import here by making use of header and then header screen boom i'm good to go save it and let's see as you can see on both devices it has been pushed at the top so now let's get started first let's create um a header style to apply to the header all right so inside my starsheet component uh, my starsheet function here i'm going to create um, a css property and this one i'll make this one container it can be anything of your choice or header container let me make it that way or container is it's okay right so here and then i will say background color is supposed to be um, let me make it gray so to be a C blue um, hash hash 72 BC D4 right and let's see let me apply it to the view component here it to be my style is equal to styles dot container let's see what we have perfect but let's give it a pardon and a pardon of both size of 15 and let me give it um bottom color of border bottom color of say um let me give it for now let me, let me make it red for now and let's see what we have i have to give it a border width before I can see the that style border width of one and now let's see what we have as you can see but let me make it a little bit so now here comes the question you want, you want to start this um, header based on the platform so my motif right now is that I want to style for the iOS I want to have um, yellow header or white header and for the Android I want to have yellow header based on a color right of your choice of your choice so because of that we need to import an a component called platform on this platform we have a function called .os that is the operating system and when it's equal to android or whatever apply that so let's demonstrate so let's say here let me console.log here console.log the platform .os is it equal to android so let's save it so with this let's go to the console and see you see the first one was false second one is true because the first one is not android is uh, ios but the second one is android 
So we're going to base on that to style our CSS. So let's head towards to the, um, the background color here. So here you're going to make a conditional um, statement that is a ternary operator. So we will say that is platform.os is equal to Android question mark. If yes, I want to style with hash 72bcd4. Otherwise, I want to style it with white background to be hash f f f f f f right so let's save it and see what we have as you can see on the android we have that but on ios we have but let me make it yellow okay so you can use any color of your choice so let me make this one by the um border bottom here let me make it gray to make it more professional okay so now on the iOS we have that and on Android we have that. So now our title has been pushed up here like that and it looks messy now. So let's apply title here. So we can apply different different um, properties based on your platform. So now let me add a title properties here and let me have margin top of say um, 40 and Text align, I want to align it to the center of it. And then next one will be the font size. The font size, let me give it 20. And the color, I want to give it a platform. Um, color is okay. Let me give it um, because uh, on the background, I have DC blue and that sometimes. So let me give it a platform um, conditional statement here. So if it's equal to um, Android, then let's go to Android. Then I want to use um, hash 72bcd4. Otherwise, I want to use the white color hash for f, 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 6 fs So let's see what you have. You have to apply to the text property so here let's add to the text right so here the style is equal to styles dot title so let's see what we have all right both are not visible because the background here is white and the text is white the background is blue and the text is blue so we I have to reverse it all right so here um for this one it will be let me cut this color here and then i want to use f f f f here and then let me paste the color here it can be any color of your choice save it and let's see now we have it perfect as you can see on the android it has been pushed more but on the ios i think it's cool so because of the pattern so here for Android, for the padding, I want to give it platform um, property here. So here for the platform, I will say if platform.os is equal to Android, then I'll give it a padding of 10, otherwise 20. Um, where is the error coming from? Platform is equal to, okay, my comma. Good, so let's see what we have. <clears throat> Save it, let me refresh again. And then I think the pattern is okay now for, yeah, I think it's still push. So let me check if it's Android 10, the pattern to be 10. Oh, sorry, the title rather, but not the pattern. Okay, because the margin top is too much for, I think it's cool for the iOS. So let me also give a platform conditional statements here. And then if it's equal to, equal to Android, I want to give it, um, let me say 20, otherwise 60. And then comma here, save it and let's see. Yeah, it's cool now. But it's okay. Let me give it instead of um, um, 60, let me give it 40. 
all right so away from that sound so let me turn this off for now all right so guys that is how we start based on the um, platform that you are using so we are going to build on this one as we move along for the news application